would be victorious in an epic battle between the F-22 Raptor and the Sukhoi Su-57. Well, this has been a topic of debate for quite some time now, which is why we would like to present you guys a comparison of these two deadliest fifth-generation jet fighters. The Lockheed Martin F-22 Raptor is a fifth-generation single-seat, twin-engine, all-weather stealth tactical fighter aircraft developed for the United States Air Force. The Sukhoi Su-57, on the other hand, is a stealth, single-seat, twin-engine, multi-role fifth-generation jet fighter being developed for the Russian Air Force and Navy for air superiority and attack operations. The unit cost of F-22 Raptor is $150 million, which makes it one of the most expensive fighter jet in the world. The Sukhoi 57 is only $42 million. As for the dimensions, the F-22 Raptor is just a bit less compared to the Sukhoi Su-57 except for its height measuring about 5 meters, whereas the Su-57 measures 4.74 meters. When it comes to weight, the Raptor is more compared to the Su-57. Even the maximum takeoff weight of the Raptor is 38,000 kg, whereas the Sukhoi is 35,000 kg. The Sukhoi Su-57 has a fuel capacity of 10,300 kg and the Raptor has only 8,200 kg. Talking about power, the F-22 is powered with a pair of Pratt & Whitney F-119PW100 augmented turbofans and the Sukhoi is powered with a pair of Saturn A141F1 turbofans with thrust vectoring. With this power, the Raptor can travel at a maximum and super cruise speeds of 2,414 and 1,963 km per hour. The Sukhoi, on the other hand, travels at 2,120 and 1,710 km per hour. Now, let's look at the range. The Sukhoi Su-57 can travel more distances compared to the Raptor with a difference of more than 500 km. But both of them have the same service ceiling and they can both fly at a maximum altitude of 20,000 meters. So let's talk about the armament. The Raptor carries weapons internally and the wings can carry four hardpoints each rated to handle 2,300 kilograms. Armament includes a 20mm M61A2 Vulcan rotary cannon, 6 AIM 120AM RAAM, 2 AIM 9 side winder, 2 450kg joint direct attack munition, or 8 GBU 39 small diameter bombs. The Su 57, on the other hand, can carry 30mm Grazov Shupanov GSH 31 auto cannon, 12 hardpoints of which 6 are internal and 6 are external. This includes RVVMD 2R73, R37M, which are air to air missiles. Air to surface missiles include 4KH38ME and KH59MK2. Anti ship missiles include 2KH35E and anti radiation missiles include 4KH58. It can also carry 1,500 kg guided bombs and 500 kg cluster bomb. Now, the most important feature in the modern world is stealth. The F-22's design maximizes sensor evasion with diamond-shaped wings and sharp faceted surfaces. The speed brake, weapon bay doors and engine exhaust are serrated to minimize the aircraft's radar signature while the large vertical canted tails reduce the fighter's infrared signature from certain angles. The aircraft's metallic surfaces are also coated with radar absorbent materials and paint. While the Sukhoi 57's design emphasizes frontal stealth with RCS reducing features most apparent in the forward hemisphere. The combined effect of airframe shape and RAM of this aircraft is estimated to have reduced the aircraft's RCS to a minimal value. Both of them are considered to be stealthy, but to compare between the two, the F-22 Raptor is more stealthier. So, the Raptor wins in terms of stealth, but what about maneuverability? Well, the use of Cray's supercomputer helped make the F-22 highly maneuverable, especially at high angles of attack. A key F-22 feature is the use of thrust vectoring in the pitch axis allowing the aircraft to combine engine power with maneuver at high angles of attack to gain an advantage in dogfights. The Su-57, however, is reportedly equipped with three-dimensional thrust vector jets giving better performance in low axis. The Su-57 is therefore more maneuverable compared to the Raptor. As for radars and avionics, 
The F-22's primary sensor, the ANAPG-77 radar, is designed to outrange enemy threats, detecting and classifying them before they even detect the aircraft, allowing this jet to not only see first but shoot first. The Su-57 includes cheek-mounted array and is also said to incorporate L-band radar arrays blended inside its large maneuvering leading-edge extensions. These radars are more for target discrimination and identification than anything else. When it comes to avionics and radars, the F-22 wins because of superior computing technology. The F-22 Raptor is quite an excellent world-beating aircraft that sits on the very top of the heap. The Su-57 as a Challenger could prove as good in many different ways and a worthy opponent for the first fifth-generation fighter jet to gain operational status. Well, of course, despite technologies, it also depends upon the pilot. If the two ever meet, it will be a battle for the ages. Anyway, thank you so much for viewing in and do comment down below regarding your opinions and thoughts. Till then, bye-bye.